Osseo's volleyball team is playing well this season. Jay Wilcox caught up with the Orioles. It's a great start for the Osseo volleyball team. The Orioles are 11-0 after Thursday night's win over Park Center. And that's after somewhat of a rebuilding year last fall when they ended up 16-11. and um, With how, how we did last year, I was hoping for a better start to the season. And we did. We, we have nine of us returning and we have one coming in um, that's new. And so I was hoping that we would kind of click and we have. To be perfectly honest, I, I kind of expected it. We only lost one girl last year and um, all of the girls played in the off season and I could see improvements as I was watching them um, during their winter seasons and was getting really excited about the season for that reason. So, Osseo is concentrating on the little things and being sharper defensively is paying off this season. We've worked hard, we worked on skills like serving, hitting, hitting spots, serve receive. We worked on key components in order to make us a stronger team. We have been doing really well with just t picking up the little things on defense and our serve receive has gotten a lot better. The great start included a tournament championship at Farmington last weekend. The Orioles do acknowledge the tougher part of the schedule is still ahead. Definitely, we got a couple of tough weeks ahead uh, next week. I mean, we play Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, so even jamming in a lot of volleyball in a week. So, um, but yeah, we play some tough ones. We got Wyzetta and Maple Grove, um, Champlin coming up, Elk River's playing well, so. The unbeaten streak hasn't been enough to get the Orioles into the top 10 in the rankings. It doesn't really bother them. I mean, under the radar, it's always a plus because some people don't see us as like the star team, but we're kind of the underdog. But I mean, we are capable of, and we're able to show, you know, the city what we're capable of. We'll find out soon if Osseo has what it takes to continue to pile up the victories. Jay Wilcox, CCX Sports. You can see the Orioles in action this coming Tuesday here on CCX as they faced Armstrong.